small world. Uh, to continue what uh, Dr. Mizbah said, uh, we have also two main uh, problems here in Egypt. We have a very large number of uh, diabetics. As you know, uh, according to the IDF Atlas, uh, the last one, we have more than 10 millions of uh, diabetics in Egypt. And unfortunately, we have a few number of well-trained uh, physicians, well-trained uh, specialists to cope with this very large number of uh, diabetic patients. So, so we need two things. First, we have to educate uh, most of the primary healthcare uh, providers because those uh, uh, healthcare providers or those junior doctors who will treat most of the cases. The specialists cannot treat all this number. So we have to uh, uh, offer a very uh, well uh, uh, structured educational program for uh, diabetics. This is number one. Number two, patients. Also, diabetes is a long life disease and lifestyle modification is very important. And we need a structured program for patient education uh, 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 in conjunction with or in cooperation with different uh, uh, bodies in the uh, country. Uh, the media has a very, very important role to carry in this uh, aspect because uh, uh, we have uh, channels specialized for cooking and every media channel have at least two hours allocated for cooking. So we need uh, in the same way, one hour per day from every channel for patient education. And we have a, a channel for the uh, uh, Ministry of Health called Hati, but unfortunately it stopped. I don't know. I, 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 I ask for uh, this channel to regain its uh, 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 rule and to start again because it's very, very important and it is a voice uh, for, for, for all the patients all over the country. Those two points, doctor education and patient education. And thank you very much.